And today we're going to be checking out these right here, Smart Sensor LED lights. That's right. These are LED lights that you can put under shelves, in closets, under the hood of your car while you're working on it, just any place you need motion activated light. Let's jump over to the bench. We're going to open them up, take a look at them, and see exactly what we're going to get. All right, so here they are right here. We're going to open this package up, see what all we get. We have a couple metal strips, and what these are for is you can mount these under cabinets, on walls, just any non-metal surface, because the built-in magnets of the lights will stick to these. You get a charge cord as well, USB to USB-C, and you're going to get not one light, but a pair of lights. How cool are these? Check them out. They're in an aluminum housing. They do have the sticky on the back with extra brackets and a little, little sticker on here letting you know where the internal magnets are. So when you go to mount them up, you have your sensor right here. The whole thing is an LED bar and both lights actually come with a set of brackets. So this is actually two extra sets of brackets. So you could mount these in other locations and you can move the lights around as needed. Very, very cool. Now I've also used lights like this for filming videos and stuff as well. They do come in quite handy. All right, so let's talk a little bit about these lights. I'm gonna show you how to use them real quick. You can see you have a light detector and you also have a motion detector as well. And on the side here, you have your USB-C port for charging and you have your switch. And this does have two different modes. Okay, so we're just gonna turn it on and this is in the auto mode. So basically, if you walked away from this and it did not sense any motion, it's gonna shut off. And then when it senses a human body nearby, it's gonna kick back on. Now the second mode, what you do is it's gonna stay off. And then when you need it, you wave your hand in front of it to activate it. And when you're done, you wave your hand in front of it to turn it back off. And that's within 10 centimeters. So if I turn this on and then I'm moving all the way back here, it's gonna still stay on. And then when I'm done, little wave and it shuts off, which is a very, very cool idea. Now we're going to turn it back on. If I just tap the button on the front, it's going to change the temperature of the light. You can see you have bright white, you have a real yellow color, and then you have a mix of the two. And then if I hold the button down, it's going to brighten it all the way up. And if I hold it down again, it's going to dim it all the way down. And so you can set it at whatever brightness you want. And then if you turn it off and turn it back on, it's going to come back to your last setting. So you don't have to reset it every time. How cool is that? Let's go ahead and put one of these lights up and see how it does. All right, so here's my 3D printer. You can see that it's inside a cabinet and that's to help me to control temperature. But you can see that it also does get dark in here. So this would be a perfect application for a light like this. And all you do is you just simply peel off the adhesive on both sides, and I'm just gonna stick it to the roof in here. Just like that. And now I have a light installed. So I have it on the first mode, so when I want the light, I can just wave my hand and it's gonna come on. Obviously, this is not bright enough, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna hold the button down that's dim, I'm gonna hold it down again, I'm gonna bring it as bright as it can get, and I'm gonna use the brightest white setting. How cool is that? So now I have light in here. And then when I was done, of course, I could just wave it off. And there you go. So as you can see, these lights can come in very handy, very useful. You can put them in shelves of cabinets. You can put them in your kitchen underneath cabinets. You can put them in your 3D printer. You can put them in your garage. There's so many places that you can put these. Another great place I can think to put them is in your closet as well. And then every time you go to look for your clothes, just wave your hand in front of it if your closet isn't already lit. And this is going to give you light in those places. We also have used these in our hallway at night. So when it detects one of the children, they will kick on and give them a light to go to the bathroom. Just tons of uses for lights like these. I hope this video helps and thanks for watching.